if your tummy doesn't look or feel the way you want it to after having babies, even a very long time after having babies, or if you're worried about abdominal separation or diastasis recti, then you're in the right place. If you pee a little or a lot when you sneeze or laugh, if sex is uncomfortable, if you're worried about prolapse symptoms, or if you just don't feel quite right down there, you're in the right place. You need to build your foundations first. You see, we need to back up a step before we exercise or strengthen the muscles of our abdomen or undercarriage. We need to find them first. We need to reconnect with parts of our body we have fallen out of love with. As well as contracting muscles, there is a vital release phase and a breathing connection to understand. As well as how to actually apply this new ninjury to your everyday life and movements. I'm going to show you how. This is your Pelvic Floor and Core 101. The Mutu Breath. Get comfortable sitting on a block or a cushion. Sit against a wall or kneel. Or lie on your back with your knees bent and feet flat. Drop your shoulders, drop your ribs and take two full breaths in your own time. Now close your eyes. As you inhale, let your stomach muscles and pelvic floor relax. Let it all go. Your muscles cannot work properly if they're switched on the whole time. When you exhale, do it through pursed lips as you lift and gently squeeze your pelvic floor. Imagine you're trying really hard not to fart as you slowly exhale. It's all connected down there. Lift up deep inside as you breathe out. Now breathe in and fully release all those muscles. Let it all relax. Keep your ribs and shoulders down. Just take a nice relaxed breath into your lungs and into your belly. Exhale and this time imagine drawing a tampon further up inside you. Or imagine picking up a grape with your vagina. Nothing forceful. It's a gentle lift and squeeze. Breathe in, let it all go. Imagine your sit bones wide apart, let go of the squeeze and let your tummy muscles fully relax. Purse your lips and exhale. Imagine this time that your vagina is a straw and you're sucking a delicious thick smoothie through it. You'll feel your ab muscles draw in as you do this. It's all good. This is your whole connected core working. Breathe in and fully relax and release, being careful not to push down or push away. This isn't a forceful movement, just release and fully let go. Breathe out, lifting up inside from your back passage all the way to the front. You'll feel your abs draw in too. It's gentle, it's subtle. Don't suck it in and don't strain. Repeat two more times, in time with your own breath, always relaxing and releasing on the inhale drawing upwards and inwards and gently squeezing on the exhale. Keep your shoulders and ribs settled down and relaxed. Do these five or six breaths at least a couple of times a day, every day. Last breath. Open your eyes. You're a little more connected. You can now engage and release your pelvic floor properly. So the next step is to apply your new skill to everyday life. Whenever you pick up a heavy load, like a child or a car seat, prepare, inhale and release first. Then engage and exhale as you lift to protect your pelvic floor and core. Let's try it with movement. Here's one exercise from the first phase of Mutu Core of our full Mutu System program, the heel drop. Lie on your back on the mat. Place a pillow under your upper shoulders and head and feel your ribs settle down towards the floor. Your knees should be bent up and your feet flat on the floor. One first and then the other. Bring your knees in toward your chest so they're resting at 90 degrees. There should be no strain at all to hold them there. So if your abs are straining just holding them in position, bring your knees in a little closer. Now exhale as you draw your abs inwards and slowly drop one heel to touch the floor. Rest your heel on the floor as you inhale. Then exhale as you bring it back. Breathe into the back of your rib cage. Exhale and engage as you drop the other heel slowly. Rest and let go, breathe in. Now exhale, engage as you bring it back. 
Keep going, moving slowly with your breath, always moving on the exhale, resting on the inhale. Your lower abdomen should draw gently in as you exhale and engage. If it bulges outwards at all, stop, regather and try again. Remember, always inhale and relax as you rest. Always exhale and engage your core and pelvic floor as you move. Keep going in time with your own breath. One more on each leg. Exhale, engage and drop the heel to the floor. Inhale, rest. Then exhale, engage as you bring it back. Last one. Drop your heel to the floor as you engage. Inhale and rest. Exhale as you move it back. Now drop one foot to the floor, then the other, and rest. <laughs>